this in and around the water 24 7. i love it the stoke started when i was four years old my dad pat mcintee handed me a cane pole and a bobber before the bottle once that bobber got bit went underwater then came up with a bluegill it was game on from then fast forward 40 years later and i still get excited to get a bite doesn't matter if it's a bluegill trout and or tuna i absolutely love it for me fishing in general makes me feel like a kid again it starts the night before you go, getting gear ready, going through tackle, setting alarms, and barely sleeping because of the anticipation of hitting the water the very next morning. Once you're on the water, I love everything that comes along with it. Early morning sunrises, the sound of nature waking up, the smell of the ocean, inner mountain air, hanging out with family and friends, and then bam, it happens. You get that bite, and I instantly turn back into that four-year-old kid again on the dock every single time. I absolutely love it. Growing up, my biggest goal in life was to work for myself. Next in line was what I'm most passionate about, traveling and fishing. Fortunately for me, I had a background in film production, which allowed me to produce a bunch of fishing videos, which led into fishing shows down the road. Some big influences in my life that motivated me to power it and do whatever it takes to chase down that dream were my parents, Kathy and Pat McEntee, true motivators. Next was a great guy named Robert August from The Endless Summer. I got to travel the globe filming surf films and seeing new cultures. Michael Falks from Inside Sport Fishing was another I was fortunate enough to work with. And last but not least, a good friend and business partner, Andrew Pereira, who's a go-getter and is definitely stoked on fishing. With all that said, it doesn't happen overnight. I've had my ups, downs, and bumpy roads along the way, but if you want something in life and are really passionate about that something, make a plan of action and go get it. The feeling you get when you accomplish that goal is priceless. Today, fishing is my entire life, but it's not just about catching fish and producing fishing shows. For me, it's about teamwork and promoting the sport of fishing and getting others inspired to get out on the water.